my first experience with Porsche was trash. Point blank period. Not Porsche in general, just the salesmen in Porsche. It's like, do better. Hire guys that are motivated. I walk in. I look dead in the, the first salesman's face. His desk is literally at the door. Look at him. He looks down and he goes back on his phone. I'm like, all right, cool. Let me look around a bit more. I look around and I guess like a front desk rep, I guess that you would call her. I don't know exactly her position, but she was like, hey, is there anything I can do for you? Are you looking for something specific? Um, can I give you some water? I was like, yeah, sure. Some water would be fine. And then tell me why he gets up and he's looking and he's like, oh, is everything okay over here? And I look at him like, so it takes another person to come approach to make sure you're doing your job. Hmm. Okay. Fast forwarding. We end up sitting at his desk to test drive and actually see if this is what I wanted. He's like, well... You know, the S and the GTS are practically the same in the Macan. I said, so how so? Explain. He explains it. I said, okay. So can I see both of them to see the difference? I was like, well, I don't have the keys. Well, can you get them? Look, there's a whole bunch of cars, da 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 I said, well, my goal is to actually see the inside. Like, I want to, I would like to see the interior. He was like, you know, what I can do is show you what's on the show floor right here. And all the Macans are the same. I said, oh, he must think I'm playing. So we go, we look in the inside, which is what I already looked at. He's explaining, yes, this is the black. It comes in red. I was like, okay, but can I actually, like, see the one I want? He was like, well, let's go ahead and get on the computer so I can show you the different interiors that we actually have. We sit there. He shows me the different colors. And he stands up and points at the cars outside to show me. You see that car right there, the base Macan, the base Cayenne, whatever. That's the, this is the color you'll see in that one. This is the color you'll see in that one. I said, oh, my goodness. You don't want to sell this. It's either one or the other. He don't want to sell it or he don't know how to sell it. I'm telling him literally everything that I'm wanting. He's doing the complete opposite, you know? And I'm trying to be real nice and cordial. I'm trying to be real cool with him. And I always ask, so, do you drive a Porsche? Like, do you recommend it as a daily? He was like, well, that's up to you to find out. How am I supposed to find out if you won't let me test drive? He kept pushing me to go towards the base model. Like, I get it. I look young, but times have changed, okay? I'm going to just be straight up, all right? Do better. Basically, fast forward. We get to going back inside because he wanted, wanted me to see the base model so bad. He's like, oh, I didn't know. I mean, now I know what you want. Sir, I've been telling you I want the S or GTS this entire time he was like well, well hang tight it's gonna take me a while so get comfortable i'm gonna go get the keys he takes his phone to the back oh i know he's gonna be there forever <laughs> so i left was i wrong for leaving comment down below but i don't think i was i'm not gonna waste my time i didn't even feel like he wanted to help first of all Porsche got to do better on getting more, you know, ambitious salesmen. Like, ones that actually want to help. Aw, man. Well. Drop that. Shoot. I dropped that all the way in there. I don't think you'd be able to get that. Anyways. That was basically the moral of the story. Second time around was way uh, smoother. Let me see if I can get it from here. Ain't no way. Mm -mm. 
Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Man, Porsche did a good job with these seeds. You ain't getting nothing out of here. You ain't getting nothing out of these cracks. I just pushed it all the way in there. Okay, well, if I can't see it, they can't see it. With that being said, I went to Porsche the second time, and it was a different location. And way better experience. The guy that sold me this car that I'm in is actually my age. That's the crazy part. Like, how is a younger salesman... I mean, I guess. Hungrier. Like, the moment I walked in there, he said, let's go test drive it. I said, oh, shoot. Okay. Let's go do it then. Let's do the dang thing. Boom. Liked it. Bought it the next day. That's why people be judging don't even know who they're judging. That is crazy. That is crazy. Everything is all about, like, perception. Nowadays, if you don't got it, they don't look at you. If you do got it, they do look at you. That was crazy. This world's crazy out here. Just be honest. It's a crazy world out here. Dang, I can't believe I really dropped that in there. Well, so I have when you in the car. So I even went to Mercedes dealership to get, you know, test drive a GLC, AMG, whatever. They don't even like you doing that. I don't know if they like don't like you doing that or because it was me. I went like I think one time or two times. I'm like, yeah. They keep pushing me to the base models. I don't understand. If I'm literally telling you what I want, why are you steady pushing me to a base model? I'm literally saying take my money, but you don't want to take my money. I don't get it. Anyways, the Mercedes story was ridiculous. He had me over there, yeah, you know, you can build it out however you like it, but you can't test drive. And, like, when I get the, uh, you're up on the next list, then I'll call you. That was three years ago. This man was playing. Anyways, I'm very grateful to get this car. Um, the guy that sold it to me at the Porsche dealership the second time around was, like, awesome. He was a great guy. That whole team in there is pretty cool. Um, that's just the experience for when I got the car. Now, I don't know about, you know, repairs or nothing like that. But we're going to find out. So, hope you enjoyed this story time. I wish I would have brought my stance. I'm really just going to be vlogging. Like, I'm in the Chick-fil-A drive through I want to have, like, a... um like a POV, like if I'm just doing stuff, it'd be cool, just random stuff, mm-hmm, that's about it, talk to y'all later. Oh, yep, 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 mm-hmm, mm-hmm, there's some damage, all right, it's dust stink in here, it smells like mildew. Oh, yeah, the carpet's wet, that's why. Oh, okay, yeah, that's what's, it just smells like mildew. No, the carpet's all wet, so. So I'm about to replace that? So, here's the thing. Mo and Kim t took pictures, and they took pictures of all the other ones that came out good. Did you see oh. it? Did you see the email? No. He probably sent it to your email. Okay, well, he took pictures of everything but that one. Okay. So, so we could still, he still can put it up. Well, we gotta wait because we gotta get this fixed. Oh. Yeah, you don't, we gotta wait till we get this done. Because if he puts it up and then people wanna come out and that's not done, then you're, so. Okay. This is nasty, but it's gonna look brand new. It's not even worried about it. Yeah. It's gonna look brand new. You gonna yeah. be able to hop? Yeah, but if I have to pay for it, it's the thing. Yeah, well, I don't, I, we don't know yet.
So this room is the master. This room looks okay, supposedly. Here's that extra bedroom that was uh, installed. And right next to it is the garage. Now, we actually came up here to sell this fridge that a previous tenant The previous tenant was living in this house when I bought it, and uh, she left this fridge behind, so I have it on Facebook. Ooh. On Facebook Marketplace, but I want to see if it actually works, first of all, before um, telling them to come get it. So... that man or is you hear that listen sweat pipe burst it's cold look at this Man, what a thing I gotta pay for. This is what happened. This is what they sent. They put that on there, so they came out and turned it on, and then turned it right off because this the pipes burst. Ridiculous. Well, it is what it is. We're gonna get that fixed. I think the inspector has already came out here. Uh, no, no, they didn't come out here yet. They're actually going to come out here next week and then to give me some feedback on it. So 